Innovation, motivation, public education. Medical and law schools have long used project-based learning because it prompts investigation, critical thinking, communication, and collaboration. Now those same qualities make project-based learning, or PBL, increasingly popular in K-12 education. The hallmarks are the same. Academic classes are interconnected, like this high school physics and transportation course. Yes, you can glue those and you can glue that. Oh, both of those are fine. Teachers construct rigorous research and problem-based lessons. They take the exact same physics test that they take in the other physics classes in the building. Uh, the difference is, is that they apply it more here. Our students tend to test a little higher. It's because of the application base, uh, because with, the, with all the vehicles, they, they see it in motion as opposed to just doing the, the problems on a piece of paper. They serve as guides and facilitators, ensuring that students develop autonomy, responsibility, and inquiry skills, as in this Top Gun project that weaves intermediate physics with transportation studies. I really want to be an engineer one day. So being able to take this physics class and work with my hands is kind of making me better prepared. PBL supporters say Katie and others are learning to collaborate and take the initiative, skills especially important in a world where globalization is the norm. Recent research finds there is also improved attendance, higher graduation rates, and fewer suspensions at Indiana's PBL schools. An Indianapolis business leader says that's partly why the workforce supports project-based learning. It's context-based learning. It requires the students to go out to different resources and to engage their brain. They're not just fed information, they have to seek it out and put it together. In the workplace, you're not fed information. You have to seek it out and put it together. It seems to me that's a real world skill that is very important. Innovation, motivation, public education giving opportunities for all Indiana children.